Where is DJ Music Man in Ruin? A huge animatronic, one of the bosses in Security Breach. I mean, he's so big, you can't miss him. But he's completely missing in the Ruin DLC. Where is he? Did he escape? Is he still around in the Pizza Plex? Or is he waiting for the next DLC? The real answer may completely shock you. You hear that? It's the sweet, sweet sound of your eternal silence. Now let's cast our minds back to Security Breach. We run into the DJ Music Man. He's a great character and he's absolutely massive. He can climb on walls and uses the tunnels around the Pizza Plex to get around. We first see him in the West Arcade in the ballroom where he's performing music in his DJ booth for the kids who visit there. And when Gregory deactivates the safety protocols, DJ MM will enter bouncer mode and disappear from the stage. This is where he crawls around the arcade on the walls, disappearing into the tunnels and eventually becomes a huge boss fight at the very end. Once he goes from bouncer mode back into DJ mode, he is seen man in the DJ booth once again with seemingly no hint of malice whatsoever towards Gregory. And that is the last we see of him until Ruin DLC. Although not appearing in the DLC at all, DJ Music Man is mentioned a couple of times by Cassie during gameplay, which is something we will talk about later on and help us solve this investigation. One such example is when Cassie stumbles upon the several wind-up music men when she comments how they look like the DJ. What are those things? They look like the DJ. With that being said, DJ Music Man is an absolute beast of an animatronic and is absolutely huge. So how is he completely missing and absent from the Ruin DLC? Where did he go? Is he even around? Well, let me continue. One of the theories is that the Music Man actually got up and left the Pizza Plex. This is kind of confirmed when the Mimic Mimic and Gregory tells us something tunneled out and broke everything. Obviously, this could be the Mimic trying to trick Cassie into thinking that Burn Trap have left or the Blob has left, as they were also under the Pizza Plex after all. Or it could be the Music man. He could easily throw arcade machines like they're pebbles and can even climb on the walls to get out. I could see him easily destroying everything in his path to escape the burning down pizza plex. But there is a huge problem with this theory. As we know from the original ending in Five Nights at Freddy's security breach, the animatronics cannot leave the pizza plex. Without a recharge station, my systems would shut down within an hour. It is a safety precaution. It is... My design. Part of this is down to them needing the recharge station, but they're also programmed not to leave. Music Man, after we deactivate his bouncer mode, simply goes back to his DJ booth. So why would he leave that even though the pizza pex is crumbling? There would be several things stopping him. So with that evidence, I do not believe he has left the pizza plex. And second to this, he is absolutely massive. A thing of that size, just leaving and going out in the open, no chance. So if he didn't leave the pizza plex, that means he is still somewhere inside of it. But where exactly is he and what happened to him? I mean, when you look at every other character in Security Breach, Freddy, Roxanne, Monty, Chica, even the little wind-up music men, they all made an appearance and came back. So where is Music Man? I mean, even the blob came back for a split second. The only hint of Music Man being in Ruin, I mean, the only bit of evidence we have is this one line. What are those things? They look like the DJ. And that is it. That's the only canon reference in Ruin. But there are various reasons as to why he is not seen or where he could be. So let me continue. As you know, the Ruin DLC is actually extremely linear. So it could be to the fact that we don't actually go to the West Arcade to see him. So that could be a theory. But if we take a closer look at Ruin, and specifically the Bonnie Bowl area, we see a whole ton of the mini DJ music men. Now, one could say this is just an added mechanic for the game to try and make it more interesting, but I do not believe that to be the case, because when you're in Bonnie Bowl, you can hear loud thumping sometimes, so I think DJ Music Man is stuck within his tunnels, and these tunnels go through Bonnie Bowl, well, essentially over or under it, because we see a bowling ball falling through one of the bowling alleys. It would make sense as to why the mini Music Men are sitting around there. They're looking for a way to free the big boss himself, big DJ Music Man. He could either be trapped in the tunnels in that area or simply sleeping and they're waiting for him to wake up because if you remember in security breach when we first see him he's sleeping on the dj music booth so all the minis are just there waiting for the return waiting for him to wake up it would make complete sense in my eyes and further to this, the West Arcade and Bonnie Bowl are right next to each other. And in a piece of cut content, they were actually meant to connect via a walkway. If you want to know all about the cut content from this game, I highly recommend checking out my cut content video after you finished watching this. So it makes a lot of sense how he could have just moved on over to Bonnie Bowl or essentially crashed through it. 
Now, another theory is the fact that we do actually see DJ Music Man, although not entirely himself. Now, if you think back to Ruin and when we come out of the daycare, we go into the theatre area. And if you put on Vanny's mask or the glitch mask, whatever you want to call it, you can see a giant endo animatronic coming through the stage. Now, a lot of people have theorised that this is indeed the Music Man's endo skeleton because we don't actually see it. Now, there is a similarity which may indicate it's the same endo because they are in the same pose as when as you see him in the west arcade essentially holding his one hand up to his ear and headphones and the giant endoskeleton is striking that exact same pose giving a similarity as such although again there are several things wrong with this theory you do actually see the music man's endoskeleton underneath he has extremely skinny arms and this endoskeleton we see in the theater does not they very much like a normal endoskeleton under the glass rocks so I do not think this is his skeleton or that this was meant to be the DJ man himself now as we know he is indeed a very large animatronic which could leave him very vulnerable to falling debris and entrapment and the fact that he's probably likely extremely heavy well we know he's very heavy because when he walks we can actually hear the sound of the weight on his footsteps very boom 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 so his weight could have very well sent him falling deeper than we could ever have imagined I mean we know there's an entire a sinkhole beneath the pizza plex where the old pizzeria simulator was from for NAF 6. We see it, we've been down there, the burn trap ending, the mimic ending, it's all there, even a scooper room. So the chances are we have not seen anywhere near what is fully under the pizza plex and the chances are Music DJ Man is down there somewhere. And this is where we could encounter him in the next game. I mean it makes sense why he's completely missing from Ruin because they're saving him for the next chapter, the next DLC where we're gonna see him in in all his glory beneath the pizza plex that would make sense as where Cassie wakes up and where the next game takes place we leave at the end of ruin at the bottom of the pizza plex it would make sense we wake up and start from there but that isn't the only place where we could see the DJ music man oh no as we said earlier ruins experience is very linear and we only visit a select few locations and one of the locations we never visit in ruin and one of the biggest locations in the entire game is the auditorium it's the major location in five nights at Freddy's security breach it serves as the gateway to all attractions in the mega pizza plex but we don't see it in ruin what if the dj music man is in there there's huge open spaces there for the dj music man to roam around in even if some places have collapsed there's plenty of ample space for him to roam in as all the other locations we've mentioned previous don't really have the space for him to roam around in and steel wool didn't think he'd fit in them locations sure you could argue that there's a lot of evidence to say that he was in Bonnie Bowl or is in Bonnie Bowl, either trapped, sleeping or otherwise, but there's also evidence to say we simply haven't encountered him yet. And like I said earlier at the start of the video, many people believed he has left because of all the destruction and the holes and the one comment from Gregory saying something tunneled out and broke everything, well that's completely disregarded. It wasn't the music man, it was the blob. If you remember, we do see the blob in ruin and it leaving the pizza plex. That is what caused all the problems, all the tunnels, all the destruction. Not not the DJ Music Man because the DJ Music Man is still inside the pizza plex. It's still an animatronic. It cannot leave. It is bound by the same rules as all the other animatronics. So the most likely story is the reason we didn't see it in Ruin is because we simply haven't encountered him yet. He is being kept for either A, the next DLC, or B, he was indeed underneath Bonnie Bowl, where we saw all the mini DJ Music Men. Regardless, I cannot wait to see his design, his withered design anyway for that matter, in the next installment, and I pray we do see him because he was such a great character. And as Freddy said, if you see the DJ, say hello. He's such a nice fellow. If you see the DJ, say hello. He is such a nice fellow. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for plenty more Five Nights at Freddy's content coming up. I'm Twisty the Twisted Animatronic, and stay safe out there, superstars.